Okay, guys, I'm so sorry I have been late for a long while, but I'm finally reviewing the Apex Legends Season 21. So there are three articles we're going to be going over, so definitely stay tuned because we'll be going over every little detail about Season 21. So, we're going to talk about um, updates coming with um, up Hevo. I, I don't know how to say that. So, new updates coming with Apex. I don't know. You know what I mean. Um, okay, so I'm going to play this trailer at the end of the video, so definitely stay tuned. So, takeover, solos. We, wait, what? We actually have a solo. Okay, chat. This is, this is actually really good. Solo is coming here. Replacing duos. <gasps> Placing duos, taking a gun on yourself, you're taking aspects from some emotion. Without having any UK for now, so let's take over. Like, <gasps> what? So let's take over his live. Nice. Okay, let's go over the new legend. I have been really late, really, really late on this new legend. Okay, when Alta emerged from her dimension into another with her past held close to the chest, she she had only two things, her inter, interdimensional, okay? So we're getting balance maps, travel, void tech, and a, dizer, and a desire to have fun. She did want, she didn't want to be wanted, never needing to stick around for the consequences of our actions, okay? Um, responsibility on things of the past, travel through that different, so she traveled throughout different realities, um, okay. Whether something is devastating was already happening or she helped, um, I'm sure the power, okay. That's basically her backstory, you can read that if you want to. So let's first go over a passive gift from the rift. Alter can see and remotely interact with nearby death boxes to claim a singer item. While she cannot take shield, the course throughout the void, any other prize can be snatched from afar. Okay, so you can basically, like, remotely, but, like, I guess from, like, if there's a, like, let's say there's a loot box 10 meters away from you, maybe you can, like, steal an item? I don't know. So, tactical. Void passage. Alto follows a void blast from a tail that shatters against the surface, opening a dimensional gateway. Through from one side to the short one side from the other for a short time crossing through the portal is in next years can be done with either direction or travel okay so this is basically like a portal Not, nothing really exciting here so now well, let's go to the ultimate void nuxus also can deploy a void nuxus that can allies remotely interact with to open a phase tunnel back to that point when a tunnel is open that player will face a walk through the location to the void nuxus and leave behind a portal that any player can follow through Nexus can can be used to even more down. Ooh, okay. And it is in pivotal way. Okay. So I'm going to show all of these, the passives, the tactical, and the ultimate on screen right now. Okay, Apex Artifacts. I, I don't know, what are these things? The path on of Apex Artifacts is spanning. Check out a blog for all the things. Okay, so we are definitely going to be go over the Apex Artifacts um, here soon. So, map update. <gasps> okay, new map update. Let's go. Oh, God, this is new up here. The update will be new. Okay. Point of interest. Oh, shit. This is fire. Okay. <sighs> okay, so this is basically what it's going to be looking like. So, it's like, I wonder if you can walk through it. My printer is mad when the quarantine zone when, you know, was wiped out by the status on it, meaning that it crashed down to the map. Um, when what appeared to the Olympus collided with the status, not satellite. Broken moon's protection was no longer allowing the crash debris and meteors to rain down along with the unknown biological material that... Oh, wait, I never even noticed that. The, the meteors, that's really cool. I know, but I should okay. For game design perspective, the goal was to deliver a faster pace and more deliberate combat experience. We condensed the whole entire of the map, making it more predictable where players can and cannot rotate from. The layer of this POI makes it fast-paced looting combat and some fun in action. So, I have no idea if, like, you get a speed boost or something in here, but I think you do. I have no idea. Uh, um, here's the next thing. Oh, sick. Okay, that's actually really sick. God damn, they cooked. Oh, you can see, like, the road, like, right here. Right there. That's sick. 
probably going to be landing here. Mega Warfare was also affected by the debris raining down, which gave us some room to play because this POI was almost um, scheduled from the rest. We felt that there was an opportunity to move it, and move it we did. Um, now look at this with our backup. Okay, so Spaceport, okay, here's basically the fall, and here's Season 21. Okay, I, I don't know about this one, like, I don't know about this, because that would be like a 1v1 thing here. That's okay, though. Um, that's a few things. Eh, it's very opened. Like, you can see the loot boxes. You can get beamed, like, right here. Yeah, it's very open. Spade Plus is a small POI that breaks. Uh, large. Okay. Cliff side. Okay. So here's before, season 20, and here's after. I love this. I love all the hills that you can go up to. So, like, you can beam people, which that's actually not good um, for, like, early matches. Cliffside sits between the current scene zone and... Oh, God. It sits between... There's another small POI with an existing X layout. Tuck of wall between the high and low grounds. Yeah, it, it's bit... Yeah. Um, also, love for like that. Okay. Solar pods. So, here's season 20. Here's 21. Oh, sick. That is actually a pretty good update. Oh, they finally blocked off that because I would always just run this way and then like somebody like right here would <laughs> while someone over here is just like <laughs> so annoying. That's sick. Oh, they kept the thing in the same place. That's actually really cool. That thingy over there. Okay. <clears throat> Solar pods utilize the new lunar buildings to introduce the on bridge between foundry and cultivation as a new POI. The intent of this placement is to speed up the pacing of the map between the POIs and offer a new combat experience within them. Okay. Here's underpass. So here's basically what it looks before. Here's basically <clears throat> what it looks after. Okay. You can see some, like, the loot boxes kind of went closer. Okay. This is actually pretty cool. Yeah. Oh, wait. That is, like, Okay, so you can go here, and then it leads you here. Yeah. Okay, I like this zipline right here. Um, underpass is another one of the small POIs that allow for a slower pace beginning for teams looking for um, less of a hot drop and also sticks to high-level goal. Okay. Oh, God, what if we fall? Oh, wait, I forgot this little floppy image. The developers forgot to add it in. Experimental Labs. Here's basically season 20 and season 1. So there is a lot of new structure here, so this is going to be, like, a hot spot in Fortnite. I don't know about this one. I think I'm gonna land um, my first game, um, probably on um, this one. This one looks kind of chill. Okay. Um, experimental Labs was an additional to Cam exist to allow for more loot, less than described landing location. Looking for some fun and rooftop to rooftop turn back. This is your job. New rotations. What would an Apex Legend map update be without some fresh and update rotations? Here's a few that you may want to be aware of getting, of avoid getting patched. So here's season 20, here's 21. Uh, it's basically the same thing, just like put some trees, put it down. Eh, I don't like how they add, they deleted this. This was really good. It's fine. Hasamat Tunnel is a new rotation that connects to the court. Oh, okay, so connects. Okay. Next one, transfer risky. For a risky but rewarding rotation, offering speed and more loot, it is, it's up to you to decide how long is too long to stick around. This tension point should allow for some fun and interesting conflict. So here's um, season 20. Season 21. Oh, shit. That's actually pretty cool. That's nice. This rotation between ter terraformer and status is nice, another actor point, and the perfect spot for strategy planning while avoiding difficult chokes. Here's another one. Okay. Pretty cool. Here's another one. Here's another one. Oh, jeez. That, those zip lines are definitely going to do one day opportunity. Oh, I love this little tiny enclosed spot. That is so cool. You could, like, camp right behind there and just wait for something. That's really cool. See you on the drop stop. With Broken Moon rising from the rubble, the long-awaited return of solos. Wait, okay, yeah. Um, a fresh path on of Apex artifacts and brand new legend. This season is just beginning. Strap in, legends. Who knows what will awaken when peace is disturbed. One more time with feeling the upheaval 
upheaval is upon us. Okay, let's go to the next article. So now we're going to be talking about whatever Apex artifacts are, because it looks like you can get some cool rewards by this. So, yeah. <sighs> what begin with the Colpat Colobalt Culture continues with a new way to personalize your Apex Legends experience. Carve your destiny with Apex artifacts, customize each variant theme, power source, and more with exotic shards. Mixing and mashing to craft your own calling card of destruction. So it looks like you can basically customize this. Apex artifacts. Apex artifacts were given to each of the les- legends by the mercenary syndicate to bring something new and exciting to the games. Distract from the recent disruption of Revenant and un- untimely death of Dura- Durodo Sil- Silva. I have no idea what the storyline is, so comment down below what is happening. Small um, particle of bathnemium identifiably powers each Qatar in order to maintain their, their ominous pe- persistence. Persistence, with the assistant and assistant of Rampart herself, the Qatars were created with the ability to be modded for customizable customization to each wielder's performance. That means you. The legends have their own heirlooms, and now you have something that's yours. Your melee, your way. It wouldn't be a Rampart influence item if it wasn't unique. First, we start with the Qatar base, the item itself, which is um, available for the via. Oh! How much is this thing? How much? I don't even want to know. I, I don't know. I don't want to know. I honestly don't want to know. Hmm, God. It may appeal in milestones, events. From there is about upgrade, upgrades. Oh, we're turning into Valent. We are turning into Valent with these spices. Okay. Um, upgrades made with bases, themes, power, and power sources. Activation emotes and death boxes. Oh, God. Oh, Apex Legends. Not your favorite skin or go for something totally random. That's sick. Okay, so it looks like you can buy one, two, three, four, five, six, six different collecting every upgrade. Okay. And then compound. So I think you have to unlock every single one to get this one. I have no idea. But these death box like, bo- boxes kind of look pretty sick. So Apex Artifact Qatar. Is this free? Is this free? I don't know, chat. Is this free? Did it say that I missed something? Is this free? Chase variant, neutral ray. Um, once all five variants of an upgrade come. Okay. So, like, let's say you get this one or buy it. And if you unlock all of this, I guess you unlock this one. Like, the level one. And then you have to. Um, once all five variants are complete. Okay. Um, each upgrade component included. The Xbox can be acquired using exotic shards. Okay. How much are exotic shards? Shut up right now. Um, oh, this is new, so it doesn't really have an answer. Okay, we got we got loaded into the game after this. Okay, we got loaded into the game. Stay tuned because we're gonna load in the game to see how much of these are. Patch notes already. Oh god, these patch. Notes. I just keep coming and coming. Okay. Um. Oh, basically the same thing. Okay. Upgrades. Level two upgrade options. Ultimate cooldown. Reduced ultimate cooldown by thirty seconds. Okay. So this is buff. Void vision. Extended highlights and see health bars are after exiting the tactical. Okay. I don't know about this one because like when they see your thing, they would like. Oh, I don't know about that one. Um, external newness. Void no longer times out. Okay, that's really cool. Tactical cooldown reduced. Tactical t- cooldown by 10 seconds. I, I don't know about that because people are just going to be like voiding too many times. Is that it? So let's take over. If you miss this, it'll be taken over. over Wait. Oh, overdo us. Okay, wait. Does that mean... No. 
Okay, so you're telling me June 24th, will it be gone? Will it be gone? I don't know. So we already basically broken back when we read the following breakdowns, Apex artifacts. Okay, patch notes. Wingman returns to the floor. Projector size reduced to pair cache values. Damage reduced to 45 was 50. Um, superior glass elite removed. Hip fire accuracy reduced. Thank you. I always want um that reduced. Don't blame me. Um, now takes booster. Okay, no longer takes magazines. Oh God. Okay. Devotion, devotion enters that cab package. I forgot what this weapon looks like, chat. Let me look it up. Let me look it up. Okay. Oh God, this used to be my friend back in like two seasons. I think. Um, new reverse hypsile. Um, damage increased to 16. Was 50. Magazine size increased to 54. Okay. That, that's pretty cool. That's, that's a nice buff. Reserve ammo, 334. Okay. Um, empty reload currency. Huh. Okay. Golden weapons location. Um, okay. That's pretty cool. Guaranteed weapons out of loot bins. Um, will contain a weapon. Thank you. That's really good. Um, bring back walls. Okay. Um, retrieving banners from death boxes. Collecting a banner will no longer lock the play out of code or cold game play actions. Okay. Okay. Um, weapons and attachment. 33, 30 to 30 repeater. Charge rifle. Longbow DMR. Triple take. Hop ups and one time dip. Okay. Oh, I like that. Oh, no. I thought we were done. Oh, look at that little bar on the side. We are not done. Okay, Ash. Um, change to left hand cast. No longer shows weapons or interrupts consumables used while launching. Okay, I used to get this bug. Um, ballistic. Um, whistle low damage from a plant to smart. Okay, increased. Ugh. Um, care package in sight removed. Okay, new slingshot and boost electric base to sling weapon and bullet level two to purple. Okay. Dev note, we will play something. Okay. Um, breakout level two, lasting bullets, small bullets. And, okay. Okay. Bloodhound, Beast of the Hunt, cooldown increased for four minutes, was three minutes. I guess. If you think about it, it's basically a Reina ult. If you think about it. Not going lie. I mean, but it's still better. Upgrades of a three tactical cooldown removed. Jeez, taste of blood buffed, gained on knock to fifty. God damn, new long hunt knocks extend beast of the hunt. Oh, okay. Um, here's basically stuff here. Catalyst piercing spikes cooldown decrease from twenty to was twenty five. Long cast upgrade interrogated into base tactical. Dark veal, dark veal length increased to 45 was 40. Okay, so you can now clear angles, angles better. Caustic. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. um, gas damage and slow now stop immediately. Oh! Okay. Because it was so annoying. When I would die, I mean, not die, when I would kill it, but it would still be there. I was like, oh my god, this is gonna end. Gas damage ramps to. <gasps> oh god, 4 to 10? Max damage knock players down to 4 was 5. Okay. Conduit. Um, Radiant Transfer can no longer target a Revenant while Forge Shadows is activated. Um, when Revenant activates a Forge Shadow, any temporary shield generation ends immediately. Gen Revenant will get any temporary shield generated before activating his ultimate. Temporarily. Okay, so you'll keep the shields. Okay. Upgrades. Battery collection removed. New bat pack. Can last up to okay. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Crypto. 
Um, new link. Um, network traffic upgrades now integrated into base kit. Squad count banners are now visible anytime the drone is in. Okay. Cool. Upgrades level two. Tact and ultimate are removed. What? Okay. Network expansion moved to level two. New quick ping. Um, improve drone healing. Okay. Level three. New satellite imagery. Drone scans for additional. Um, 1.5 seconds. New hack done. Cut the drone. Um, quarter. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. Fuse. Big bang. Removed. They, they just they just removed it. Okay. Um, new ring master gain access to ring consoles. Scar tissue. Simplified above damage migration to removed lingering burn effects. Take a flat 20 damage when crossing the model instead of. Okay. 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 Let's <laughs> make what it is. Um. God. Um. Okay. Um. Newcastle. Mobile shield throw. Admin and speed. <laughs> Admin speed increased. 2.5 times faster. Castle wall and will now destroy incoming. Okay. I did try to find the wall. Fire door from behind the wall. No bombing from on the left. All containment. Um, castle wall. Energized duration increased to one minute. Upgrade stronghold increased energized duration to three. It was 2.5. Octane. Upgrades. Reckless removed. Another removed today. Actually, that's probably five. I have no idea, chat. Um, Matt Hops moved to level two. Thick skin now at level two and level three. Basically, what it is. Watson. Um, upgrades. Failing stars palin will stop spawning. Arc stars when the squad is eliminated. Split care. Socket will no longer reduce shield regen. Um, counter. Wrath into the void dimension. If nearby enemies will be highlighted for play uh, players travel. Okay. I don't know about that one, though. I mean, it's not every day that um, you get a good wraith. Not really, if you think about it. But. A um, map. Broken moon shattered. New POIs. Cliffside. Experimental labs. Solar pods. Spaceport. Quarantine zone. On the past. Okay, these are all the new um, stuff. Baker have updated. Okay. Mode. Solo. 50. 50! Oh jeez, I should have kept it. Six week dude duo takeover. So does that mean like solo will be gone in six weeks? Second chance respawn. Automatically respawn if you die for the in the first okay. Uh, I don't know about that. I don't automatically mmm. Ah, second chance covered into the Evo using Battle Heaven. Um, auto heals, health regenerations out of combat. Auto heals start after each kill. I don't like that. Um, wait, health regen. Okay. Um, uh, mixtape. Lockdown added to rotation. Zeus, um, Zell. Zeus station momentum. So this is basically all the rotations here. Mix that rotation. Ranked all players, premium and rave will speed with their three ranked tiers. Okay. Okay. I wish they would do it kind of like Overwatch, with you can play like with your friend if you're in like, um, plat. Is plat a rank? And then like your other friend is bronze. Um, but then it takes on cure time. But you match up with the same people. But hey, at least it showed a cure time in more games. I don't know. No turning changes to be made to ranked scoring for the launches. Okay. Um, uh, bug fixes. Um, we can read over that right here. Um, Legend Blastic Duration. Oh, we already kind of talked about this. Um, quality of life. Um, graphics. That's cool. And that's it. Is that it? Chat? Please? Okay, that is it. I'm going to put the trailer up right now. So, I hope you guys have a great day, and, um, subscribe, please. I really need